Hi guys. It's the day before I go to Germany. I'm going to Berlin to go visit my friend who lives in Germany. Um, and it's a busy day. I worked today at my main job and, and um, I gave finals for pharmacology, which is, you know, medicine. <laughs> and then, um, so tomorrow I am flying out of LAX. So I'm gonna do LAX, Newark, Newark, um, Berlin. And I'm nervous. I, I don't really travel by myself so much anymore. I used to all the time when I was younger. But then for these past few years, everywhere I go, I, I always have someone with me, like my, my kids, my husband, somebody. So it's gonna be weird to go all the way to the other part of the world um, to, um, by myself and standby but I'm gonna have a blast I'm excited about it so um, you know how it is the day before you travel you have quite a few things to do so what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna go to the bank and I need to get some bureaus I just don't want to have to deal with that when I'm at the airport or when I'm there um, so I'm gonna go ahead and get some euros from my bank and then I'm gonna go to the grocery store get a few things for my house my husband and kids and then I'm gonna get myself some snacks for a bit for my travel and my voyage um, because you know how airport airport food is very expensive and um and it doesn't taste that great so to be able to kind of bring stuff from home um it'll be good for me so that's what i'm doing now i'm already packed i did my toiletries i did my um my clothes everything um comfortable clothes is what i want to do um i hope you guys can see me um so that's what I'm going to be doing. Um, I'll bring you guys along the journey with me though. I hope you guys are doing well and I'll talk to you guys later. Okay, so it's 4.45 and my flight is at 6.35. I have to check in for an international flight um, with my passport and everything. It's, it didn't really scan well online last night through the app, so I have to go ahead and check in and um, go through TSA. So far, so good. God willing, I make all the flights. So I was looking on and it's a total full flight so it's going to take a miracle for me to get on. Normally when I travel I'm with my family and my kids so I make sure that it's a flight that's super super open. Um, so we'll see what happens with this. I don't know if it's because of weather or anything that's happened recently. I hope you guys can hear me. Um, there's um, two people or like there's a few people on standby I'm number two on standby out of I think five so hopefully I make it um, there's obviously going to be people that don't um, make the cutoff for their bags or for check-in so hopefully um, that'll help us standbys I'll let you guys know so I'm number three on the standby list now um, and um, so hopefully I mean it's an early flight and a lot of times um, people don't show up or they don't make their um they don't make it through TSA in time so that's gonna actually help me so um, we will find out if you look over there hold on just dropped my stuff everything um everyone's already boarded so, so everybody else is on the plane so um they just told me to wait and um see hopefully with that nice cutoff that they have um the standbys will get on Go home. What, honey? 
Like you can tell that this is a hub because there are so many planes. It's crazy. So I made it. I'm in New York right now and um, I'm walking to my gate. I got in at um, on 80 and I need to get to, I see 80 and I think I need to go to 131. So it's gonna be a long drive, a long walk, but I need to exercise because I've been stuck on the plane this whole time. gonna be boarding soon so I'll just have to wait for my name and then um, go from there hopefully if I hear my name so what I was trying to um, I actually went on the employee website to see exactly how many seats there were and there are 17 seats 11 standby I think I'm like number five so I think it should be okay right now it is 431 I think they're gonna start boarding probably in about 20 minutes or so, so it should be good. It looks like a big plane. I'm not sure, I didn't really look. I think it's a 777, but I'll let you guys know. So it's about 7.55 um, and boarding starts around 8.55. I have to check the boarding and um, just make sure that I hopefully make the flight. Um, it looked really full, so pray that I make it. Um, I didn't notice any other standbys on, so we'll see. I'll let you guys know. Okay, so I looked on it and it said um, three on standby. I'm three. I'm number three on standby. There are nine seats available, so it looks like it's pretty good. Um, they should be having a cutoff very soon um, of not allowing any more people to purchase tickets, get on the plane, all that kind of stuff. So hopefully, um, let's see if the flight's at 930. I don't know, about 30 minutes or so um, before, because it's international, generally about an hour before the flight, they stop um, allowing, you know, movement when it comes to that. So, so far, so good. You will need the latest version of the United app already downloaded on your device prior to departure. So I landed in Newark. I made it from Berlin here, which I'm very excited about. So um, the great thing about Newark to LA, there's a flight every hour um, 
the problem is these flights are really full. I don't know if it's weather or something going on, but every single flight is full. This first flight that I'm on, I'm number three on the standby list. There's only one seat available. I haven't really checked in like 45 minutes because it took forever to go through customs. So hopefully I can get on this first flight and I'm not waiting in the airport a lot. So God willing, I'll, I'll let you guys know in a minute. Okay, so what's going on is that it's a completely full flight. Um, everyone's gotten on. They're missing 18 people, so the only way I'll make it is if those people don't show up. It's about 35 minutes before um, the plane leaves. I think they might have a cutoff in about 20 minutes, so I'm praying that at least three or four people don't show up so that I make the flight. So I'm home, I'm, LA. I'm in LA, so I'm so happy. I have to go to baggage claim to get my stuff um, because I was one of the last people to get on board because obviously we had to wait until people didn't get on, um, didn't make their flight for me to get on because it was not an open flight. And um, so I have to go down to baggage claim because all the overhead bin space was all taken up. So I'm gonna go do that, go get my car and drive home. Hi guys, I never finished um, like closing up the vlog from um, my Germany vlog and um, I kind of needed to do that. Um, I work today. So that was Sunday. I got home Sunday night. Today is Tuesday. So yesterday I, okay, so thank the Lord I made every flight. It's been just crazy travel. I don't know for non-revs and everything. I'm thankful that I made every flight. There was only one of me. I mean, if I had traveled with my entire family of five of us, we wouldn't have made those flights. Um, so I came off learning that it's so much easier, obviously, to travel with one person. I wasn't as careful as I normally am, but I needed to get there this weekend, um, this past weekend, to go hang out with her because that was the only time that she had available. Um, but it was good. It was great. I'm so thankful. It makes me really happy to go to work because I'm able to use my benefits and... Um, I'd just be very thankful for the situation that I'm in. Um, I will be working today. I'm probably going to do a vlog today. I'm not 100% sure. Um, but um, I am working today. A long, long, long shift. Um, from 11 a.m. till closing. Um, there's going to be a few hours um, a break in between shifts. But pretty much I'll be working throughout the day. Um, I hope you guys are doing well. And I will see you guys later. Bye.